In Karnataka, Chikkabalapura is one of the drought prone districts which falls under eastern dry zone. The average annual rainfall is 720 mm with 37 rainy days. Red sandy and red sandy loam are major soil types. Major climatic variability challenges like unpredictable onset and erratic distribution of monsoon with deficit rainfall was observed. Livestock being major enterprise for livelihood security, animals suffered due to shortage of green fodder. Indian Council of Agricultural Research Krishi Vigyana Kendra Chikkabalapura selected yes Raguttahalli and Madamangala villages of Chintamani taluk to implement national initiative on climate resilient agriculture NICRA project since 2011 with the support of CRIDA Hyderabad and ICAR New Delhi field crops like ragi red gram groundnut field bean and horticulture crops like mango cashew tamarind and jamun are cultivated total cultivated area in nikra villages is 264.27 hectares out of which 207 hectares area comes under rain fed less adoption of improved varieties non adoption of soil and water conservation technologies labor scarcity non availability of farm implements less awareness about improved technologies in pest and disease management were the major constraints observed in nikra villages national innovations in climate resilient agriculture is a network project of indian council of agriculture research new delhi launched in 2011 in the country uh, to identify the uh, climatic uh, variability and demonstrate available technologies to uh, adapt and mitigate the drought situations so with the intervention of this uh, nikra project uh, allotted from atari icr new delhi we have selected this village and we have initiated uh, resilient uh, activities and the university is supporting this uh, nikra project so technical support wherever it is required surface meteorological observatory was established to record temperature rainfall and humidity which helped to provide timely weather based agromet advisories to the farmers four intervention modules were implemented as a part of the project natural resource management nrm crop production livestock and fisheries institutional interventions under the natural resource management module 13 percolation tanks 8 farm ponds 1 nala band 2 check dams trench cum bunds in 45 hectares were constructed and desilting was done in existing tanks with 13825 cubic meter area all these enormous activities has created rainwater storage capacity of around 3 crore liters and has enhanced the rechargeability of the bore wells to an extent of 73% over period of time ಮಣ್ಣು ಮತ್ತು ನೀರು ಶೇಖರಣೆ ಮತ್ತು ಸಂಸ್ಕರಣೆ ಬಗ್ಗೆ ಈ ಥರ ನಾವು ಕೊಚ್ಕೊಂಡು ಹೋಗಿದ್ದೀರ ನಮ್ಮ ಭೂಮಿಯಲ್ಲಿ ಬದುಕಲು ಹಾಕ್ಕೊಟ್ಟಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಈ ಥರ ಕೃಷಿ ಬಂಡಗಳು ಮಾಡಿದ್ದಾರೆ ನಾಲ ಬಂಡಗಳು ಮಾಡಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಚೆಕ್ ಡ್ಯಾಮ್ಗಳು ಹಾಕಿಸಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಮೂರು ನಾಲ್ಕು ವರ್ಷದಲ್ಲಿ ಸರ್ ಎಲ್ಲ ಕೆರೆಗಳೆಲ್ಲ ತುಂಬ ಇದ್ದಾವೆ ಸುತ್ತಲೂ ಈ ಕಡೆ ಎಲ್ಲ ಬ ಹೊಲಗಳೆಲ್ಲ ಬದುಕಲು ಹಾಕಿಸ್ ಎಲ್ಲ ನಿಂತ್ಕೊಂಡು ಭೂಮಿಯಲ್ಲೇ ಹಂಗೆ ಬಿಡ್ತೀವಿ ಎಲ್ಲ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟಾಗಿ ನೀರು ಮೊದಲೆಲ್ಲ ಸಾವಿರದ ಸಾವಿರದ ಐನೂರು ಎಲ್ಲ ಓಡಿಸ್ತಾ ಇದ್ವಿ ನೀರು ಬರ್ತಾ ಇರಲಿಲ್ಲ ಈಗೆಲ್ಲ ನೂರು ಇನ್ನೂರು ಆಗಿದ್ರು ನಮ್ಮ ಕಡೆ ನೀರು ಬರ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದಾವೆ ಬೋ ಬೋರೆ ಹಾಕೋರು ಕಮ್ಮಿ ಹಾಕ್ಬಿಟ್ಟಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಸರ್ ಈಗ ಬೋರೆಲ್ಲ ಮಾರ್ಚ್ ಏಪ್ರಿಲಲ್ಲಿ ನೀರು ಕಮ್ಮಿ ಬಂದುಬಿಡ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ಸರ್ ಆವಾಗ ನಮ್ಮ ಟ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ಬಂದು ಏಳ್ನೂರು ರೂಪಾಯಿ ಓಡಿಸ್ಕೊಳ್ತಾ ಇದ್ವಿ ಈಗ ಏನಂದರೆ ಇವಾಗ ನಮಗೆ ಮಲೆ ಜಾಯ ಜನ ಕೃಷಿ ಮಾಡೋದು ಇದು ಹೊಡ್ಕೊಂಡಾಗಿಂದ ನಮಗೆ ಇದಾಗ ಬೋರ್ವೆಲ್ ಎಲ್ಲ ರೀಚಾರ್ಜ್ ಆಗಿ ಪರವಾಗಿಲ್ಲ ಸರ್ ನಾವು ಏನು ಇದು ಟ್ಯಾಂಕರ್ ಏನು ಓಡಿಸಂಗಿಲ್ಲ ಈ ಕೃಷಿ ಮಾಡೋದ ಡ್ರಿಪ್ ಮೋಟ್ರ್ ಹಾಕ್ಕೊಂಡು ಡ್ರಿಪ್ ಮುಖಾಂತರ ನೀರು ಬಿಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದೀವಿ before the implementation of the project low yielding cultivars were being used 
and monocropping was followed. Because of prolonged dry spells, KVK Chikabalapura has introduced medium and short duration biotic and abiotic stress tolerant and high yielding varieties like ML365 of Ragi, BRG1, BRG2 and BRG5 of Redgram and K6 of Groundnut. Redgram based intercropping system with Groundnut, Ragi, Field Bean and Minor Millets were demonstrated to improve crop climate resilience. About 90% of the farmers have adopted improved technologies in red gram. To overcome the drought situation, contingent crops like horse gram, PHG9 and foxtail millet, DHFT1031 were introduced. To bring long-term sustainability in view of the climatic vulnerability involved in field crop cultivation, dryland horticulture with mango, cashew, tamarind, custard apple, jamun, lemon and drumstick mixed fruit orchards was promoted. In-situ green manuring with horse gram sun hemp was introduced in mango and cashew orchards to improve the soil fertility. under the livestock and fisheries module, multi cut fodder sorghum varieties COFS29 and COFS31 were introduced. Programs based on feed management, animal health camps, disease management, strategies to overcome infertility problems in livestock were organized and improved breeds like Karatnath poultry bird, Nauri Suvarna sheep breed were introduced. Agroforestry was promoted with the crops like Melia dubia, Hebbevu, Drumstick, Sesbania grandiflora, Agase to meet the fodder requirement during drought situation. Under the institutional intervention module, a custom hiring center was established to overcome the labor scarcity wherein need-based improved form implements like tractor-drawn rotovator, post hole digger, disc harrow, brush cutter, MB plows, tined plows, seed cum fertilizer drill, power sprayers, raised bed maker, cycle weeders, water lifting pump, groundnut decorticator were kept for hiring on rental basis. Custom Hiring Management Committee was constituted for decision making on hiring and maintenance of farm implements. Badge normal lagi ganta ke stunta ayatu arwatu a yantrop karna mele depend petrol dadre bere diesel dadre bere iduku ipatrupai ipatai drupai. Bari and Kola, Udlu nipping aga kail nipping murdre, one de Kerege, Aidijana, Arjana, Sumaru Yerdu, Yersaura, Yersaura, Inur Saurupa Agodo. Ega was a technology bandide. Oba Alo, one de Kerege, Upeos Bodo. Andre Yersaura Ulta Agate. In order to create awareness about the climate resilient technologies, extension activities like agro advisory services, trainings, group discussions, demonstrations, Kisan Melas and exposure visits were organized. Different interventions of ICAR KVK Chikbalapura in Nikra villages has made significant impact on water table increase.
borewell recharge, soil conservation, adoption of improved crop technologies and intercropping system by the farmers to overcome the risk of crop failure. Red gram based intercropping system was more preferred over the ragi based system. Farm mechanization has taken over the problem of labor scarcity for timely agriculture operations with efficient energy use. Ultimately, the farmers were empowered themselves to vibrant climate aberrations and self-sufficient in farm production with stable income. By seeing these technologies in the Nikra villages, that is Esragutali as well as Madhamangala, even many adjacent farmers from the other villages or neighboring villages are coming forward and they are adopting uh, these technologies. Mr. Aniruddha Shravan, uh, the commissioner of uh, Panchayat Raj, they have adopted uh, our uh, almost uh, technology that is a trench comb bund, almost in the entire state and also bund uh, planting. So, we will going to uh, suggest government to adapt the same technologies particularly to the other villages, other uh, subsequent other adjacent villages uh, in the same area and even in the other parts of the state as well as in the country.